Yo, what is up everyone, and welcome back to another video. My name is Joshua Wiggins, and in this video, I want to go over how to create this really cool Luma Key glitch effect. Now, this is what the effect looks like. It creates this really cool, like, glowing um, RGB glitch effect. So, I'm going to go over basically how to create this effect. Now, let's go over to this clip right here. Now, this clip has the prism blur and the bad TV. Well, this effect over here has the Luma key. So let's go ahead and just kind of go over the basics of how to create this. So I'm gonna copy the clip um, right here and let's head over here and I'm just gonna get rid of the effects um, right here. So what you wanna do first is you wanna take this clip and you wanna hold down option or you wanna click copy and paste. These two clips are copies of each other. Now on this bottom clip right here, you wanna head over to the effects panel right here and you want to type in the prism effect. So let's head over to the prism effect, apply the prism effect onto the video right here. And now you wanna head over and add a bad TV effect um, right here. So you want to apply a bad TV effect to the effect right here. So I'll go ahead and to the video right here and I'll go ahead and disable it right here. Now as you can see right here, I'll go ahead and kind of go right here, but I changed the amount to 30. So let's change this amount um, to 30 right here. And then I believe I increased the prism blur a little bit. Um, so let's go over to this clip right here. And I increased the prism, the prism blur to about 20. So let's apply it right here or increase it a little bit. And then what I just did was I just turned the prism blur up a little bit. So as you can see um, right there, so let's see how close it is to the original clip right here. So this is what the original clip looks like. As you can see, that's pretty much identical. Now what you want to do next is you want to apply a Luma key effect to the video. So let's head over here to all and let's type in the Luma key right here. The Luma key right here. Let's apply the Luma key uh, to the video right here. And then you want to go over here and you want to start adjusting the uh, Luma key right here. And that might, that's pretty close to the original clip right here. So let's go ahead and just check. So here is the one that we edited. So let's head over to here. It's almost completely identical. So let's go ahead and play it right here. And this is what the effect looks like. It creates a really cool glowing glitchy effect whatever you want to call it definitely really cool and really interesting now if you don't want the luma key this is what the effect looks like but with the luma key here that's what it looks like it's definitely a really cool and really interesting effect so again these two clips are copies of each other this top clip has the luma key here and then here are the settings that i adjust um, the bottom clip has the prism blur and the bad TV effect. You want to make sure that the prism blur is above the bad TV effect or else the effect isn't going to work. So that's pretty much how to create this really cool Luma key glitch effect. Anyways, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully you found it helpful and informative. If you're new to this channel, I upload Final Cut Pro 10 tutorials every day at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So if you enjoy these types of videos, consider hitting that subscribe button. I also have Final Cut Pro 10 tutorial playlist with over 100 Final Cut Pro 10 tutorials. See you in the next one. Peace.